Hello guys, welcome to another weekly vlog. So we thought we'd start off uh, with our sort of... Magic mail? Yeah. <laughs> Number one of the week. <laughs> so we recently became brand reps for a wax melt company Yeah. called Homemade Magic by Shawl. So we got a package sent today. I ordered some and then she sent us some more as well. So we'll just go through what we've got. So the first melt that we've got is a jasmine one. Ooh. This one, it's really thick as well. Yeah, it's like a tart, I think they would call it. Yeah, looks good enough to eat. <laughs> Don't. <laughs> and then we've got these three little Mickey ones. There we go. And oh, one. and there you go. <laughs> <laughs> They're really cute. And then some of them are postman. Even though it said fragile on them, he wasn't very fragile with them. Yeah, he's not the best of um, posties, is he? No. But yeah, the Mickey shaped ones, anyway, like they're bigger. Anyway, he's broke, but... Yeah. Damn you, postman! I know, he literally always breaks wax out, doesn't he? Yeah. And that's like a candy cane one. Ooh. I love a candy uh, yeah. cane. Wax out. That's one of my favourite Reminds me of ones. Christmas. If you want to see it. photos of them properly, we'll just put them on the Instagram, so... And then you get the little dwarves as well. You got Doopy there. <laughs> Look how cute he is. It's not focused. We'll we'll put the proper photos. So you'll see. Camera's you know. no good. <laughs> yeah, it just doesn't like focusing on small things when your face is in the shot. So that's basically it. Yeah. Plenty of wax melts to keep us uh, <laughs> to keep us entertained. Yeah. So if you do want to get anything on her Etsy store, our code is Emily Ten for ten percent off. No. And they're already really cheap anyway. So. Yeah, they're really well priced, I think. Yeah. So we're currently watching Coronation Street, which is our. Right, up there. Wednesdays, Mondays and Fridays. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, and we just ordered some desserts, didn't mm. we? So um, there's a bakery that's like quite close to us, isn't there? And uh, they've just opened like a uh, Just Eat, haven't they? So um, we're going to take them out, aren't we? In fact, we've had from there before. Um, but then, yeah, obviously, because of the lockdown and stuff, they've started doing deliveries. So really excited for that. <laughs> so. Our dessert takeaway has just arrived. We got these like what they call cookie cups. I think it's just like edible cookie dough. And we've got two biscoff and two toffee. Uh, but we're not going to have them right now. We're going to have like save them, aren't we? Yeah, tomorrow or whenever. Yeah. And then we got, what did we get? Brownies. Uh, I can't really remember what we had. <laughs> uh, we uh, had Mars bar and toffee and then Milky Way and like crispy rolls. So we're going to sit back and enjoy these. Um, <laughs> And watch some retro Love Island. Yeah, so these um, are two of the best ones. Yeah, so we'll give you our verdict once we've actually finished because mm -hmm. just gotta eat them now because they're warm. Mm. <laughs> we got defeated. Yeah, I mean, the cookie cups were just, we were gonna save, we're saving them anyway. Yeah, like we? in the week. But... Yeah. But those brownies, I mean. We should have got one to share, I think. <sighs> yeah. Because we only managed to eat like. Yeah. <laughs> I'm this like, that one. Yeah, and then the other one. So, like, the plan was always to, because we got two different flavours just so that we could try both of them. So we were sharing each one anyway, but I wish we'd have just, like... Got one. Yeah. And just saved the other one or just not got it at all. Yeah. Um, but we'll eat it. We'll eat it, don't worry. Yeah, we'll re-eat it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> not going to waste. Uh, at the moment, it's just too bloated to... Yeah. Do anything. It's good though for the whole three minutes that I could manage. Oh yeah. <laughs> it was very like cloggy though. Like there was that much chocolate. I was like, <gasps> <laughs> but. So if you know us, you know that we love a bit of gin, and we found this watermelon and kiwi gin by Whitley Neal in Tesco. So we thought we'll give it a go. Um, we had originally got it for tomorrow's quiz night to drink along with that um, but we're gonna have a glass tonight just to test it out and try it because why not Mm. That's so nice. <laughs> yeah, I smelled it and I thought it doesn't smell of anything, but 
Mm. That's actually really good. So, chin chin. So we just filmed our Disneyland Paris um, Never Have I Ever video, um, which will already be up, so I'll leave it whichever side it is. Um, but our Universal quiz is tonight, so I'm going to get changed out of this and uh, well, into this. There we go, thing two, all ready for the Universal quiz. Emma's just got into her Stranger Things top, repping that Universal life. <laughs> There's only about, is it about half an hour, something like that, just about over, an hour. yeah, um, till our stream. So the nerves are starting to set in now. Nah. No. Okay. We've got gin, um, which we showed you last night. Uh, we're gonna have some of that whilst we're on stream, aren't we? I'm probably one now while we wait. It's not a bad idea. Did someone say gin? <laughs> <laughs> so we've got our gins at the ready and the streaming software open, as well as Kahoot. Uh, got a nice little like video playing there, uh, you know, just ready as the lobby video. And uh, yeah. We always like look forward, but like get nervous for the live streams, don't we? Yeah, like no one's gonna join and we'll just be like sat there. <laughs> yeah, cause like it's a lot easier to like live stream if you're in a park or something, cause you're bound to have someone that will tune in. But then with the quizzes, like, if the topic isn't for everyone's liking, not everyone's mm. going to tune in. Um, but last week was the most people we've ever had, isn't yeah. it? So, fingers crossed. <laughs> um, I mean, Universal is a popular subject, isn't it? So, yeah. we'll, we'll see. see. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, we really enjoy doing them. It takes us only, well, we could probably get the questions done in a day if we wanted to, but we yeah, spread we it out slowly over the week just so that. Drive you insane if you just stay on one night trying to do it all. Yeah, yeah. We're not 100% sure on what we're going to do for next week, but we're thinking like a pop culture sort of 90s sort of quiz, aren't we? Yeah. So we'll see, um, but for the time being, universal. So it's that regularly scheduled <laughs> segment of the weekly vlog where we answer some of your questions. So we've got five for now, um, and we've saved a few for next week, haven't we, basically. So, first off. What do you miss most about Disney? Um, just the feeling that you get when you're there, just like. No worries. Yeah, and like the escapism, the characters, just everything, mm. basically. Yeah, the yeah. food. Oh yeah, and the food. What inspired you to vlog? It was more my idea, really, wasn't it? We had like the, the Twitter and the Instagram for about a year yeah. at the time, and then because I studied um, media in uni and everything, so I knew about like cameras and stuff like that. I mean, we did only start with like a phone, like to vlog at the beginning, didn't we? Um, and just yeah, how like positive the community is and stuff like that, and we enjoyed watching other people's vlogs. Yeah. Anyway, so it was just sort of. Let's give it a go and see how it see how it goes because that's why we used the phone at the beginning because we didn't want to spend money on. Yeah, not carry on. Yeah. Where would you like to be right now? Disney. Yeah. <laughs> or a beach. Yeah, just anywhere <laughs> that isn't the UK, basically. Yeah. Um, Sunshine. Yeah. With just, a cocktail. Just missing it all, basically. <laughs> just being away. Yeah. Who's your favourite Disney couple? Who's yours? Mm, well, I've got two. Okay. Which is Belle and the Beast, and then Rapunzel and Flynn. Yeah, I'd probably say Rapunzel and Flynn. Um, I've sort of got into that film a lot more recently. Um, I constantly watch it. Yeah, and then probably Aladdin and Jasmine. Just because. And Hercules and Mecca, like them. Too. Oh, yeah. And last one Blackpool Pleasure Beach or Alton Towers? Ooh. I like them both for different reasons. Mm, if I had to pick one to go to, it would be Alton Towers, I think. Yeah, like the. more to do. Yeah, the theming and everything in Alton Towers is probably better. Like, Pleasure Beach is not. Um, it's not. Like, they don't focus on the theming, really. No. It's just more, like, rides that are there. Kind the of old thing. style rides. Yeah, especially all, like, the wooden ones that, like, they rattle you, don't they? <laughs> yeah. Um, on, this, this weekend should have been their like opening weekend as well for the season. So, because um, we had thought about going, mm. oh, well, obviously when they thought that they were going to be opening, but obviously they went back on that. Didn't they? But 
yeah, we had thought about going for the opening weekend just to see what it was like because there's a lot of like, I see it all the time on Twitter, people saying, oh, opening weekend at Pleasure Beach is always like really fun, like everyone's so thing, but yeah, they, they obviously <laughs> didn't really plan ahead. So um, in our time, <laughs> uh, the giveaway's just gone live pretty much, isn't it? Yeah. Um, about a couple of hours ago. Um, but by the time you watch this, you'll have like a day to enter. Not even that, a few hours. Yeah, because... <laughs> We want a. We're picking a winner on Thursday. Yeah, so. just so that as soon as we pick a winner, we can get it sent out in time for Valentine's Day, which is on Sunday. Sunday, yeah. So we really need to get out as soon as possible, pretty much, because um, we don't want like because that's the whole idea of the giveaway is it's yeah. a Valentine's quiz. So a uh, quiz. <laughs> giveaway. <laughs> giveaway. We are doing a Valentine's quiz. Well, not really a Valentine's theme, is mm. it? But. It's like a rom-com, um, like... Chick flick. Chick flick kind of thing. Um, just something different and it completely different <laughs> to what we've been usually doing. So, um, we were going to do like a 90s sort of, um, sort of pop quiz. Yeah, different um, things. But because we realised that Valentine's Day is next week, or in a few days, if you're watching this now, then, uh, it just made sense to do that more than a yeah. 90s quiz. We'll probably do that in an, a, like a few weeks or whatever, but yeah, so that's the plan for now at least. So if you are playing that quiz on Friday, um, I know there isn't much time, but uh, we, we were thinking, weren't we? If you want to like give a shout out to someone special or anything <laughs> like that, whether it be anonymous or not, uh, let us know uh, on Instagram, send us a DM on there and uh, we're gonna try and do like a little video, aren't we? Like a surprise sort of video. Whether if we get enough people sending stuff, then we will. Yeah. If not, not just like one. Yeah. If not, we won't. But um, I think it'd just be funny, something different, won't it? Yeah. <laughs> so if you do want to, uh, let us know over on Instagram, and we'll we'll sort something out, won't we? Hello. <laughs> <laughs> um. So it is Super Bowl day, isn't it? So we have never ever watched the Super Bowl. No. Um, ever, basically. <laughs> um, but it, I don't even know who's playing. Who I think it's Tampa, the ta Tampa Bay Buccaneers, but I don't know who they're against. Chiefs. I don't know. I'm glad, I'm glad <laughs> we've done our research. <laughs> um, but yeah, we're going to give it a go. I'm going to watch it, see what happens. We've probably got, watch about five minutes of it. And get yeah, we, we've got a few <laughs> drinks, so that'll probably help. <laughs> but we're going to make some um, school cake aren't we? Mm -hmm. So <laughs> if you're not from the UK um, then you probably won't really know what this is. <laughs> it's just basically sponge with a bit of icing on it isn't it? And um, we've not had it in years. No. So we're gonna make some um, and have it with some custard. So by the time this is actually done Super Bowl should be on in theory but we'll see. So the sponge has been cooked. I don't really understand what's gone on like it's sort of higher in the corners than it is. So we're just going to wait for that to cool and then put the icing on it basically, aren't mm -hmm. we? So we've got our icing here. <laughs> um, we have cut off a little bit of the sponge because we were curious as to how it was because it looked a bit weird, didn't it? Yeah. <laughs> So we got our drinks, and they're just doing the uh, national anthem, aren't they? Um, still don't quite know <laughs> rules <going> on? <laughs> or anything like that, um, but we are supporting. Tampa. Yeah. Bay. Buccaneers. Buccaneers. Because <laughs> <laughs> uh, they're in the Raymond James uh, Stadium, which is in Tampa Bay, um, and because of it being, you know, close to Orlando, we thought we'll support them. <laughs> Basically, that's our like that's our reasoning anyway mm. um but looking forward to it it's the first time we've actually watched it, isn't it? so don't even like english football um no i'm not a big fan of english football to be honest don't like any sport so this will be fun i've been to one rugby game and i got really into that so 
we'll see. <laughs> Everyone's making a big deal of it, so why not? One thing that did like that is like confusing is is the amount of people that are in the stadium. <laughs> like they I know they say that it's like less capacity because of everything going on, but like it looks pretty full to me. It looks pretty yeah, it looks pretty full to me. <laughs> you you're doing a good like you you could easily fool me. All the seats look full. Yeah. Like that seems like a lot of people in that stadium. Uh, <laughs> I would like say that that's pretty full but then again I don't know there doesn't look like a lot of um social distance in there and we could be completely wrong there might be like proper like procedures for it like they might be saying like everyone has to have a test before coming or something I don't know but it is a bit weird isn't it yeah <laughs> I don't remember what it was like being in the crowd like that no it's so <laughs> strange looking at it so uh, thoughts so far on Super Bowl I don't know <laughs> uh, we're almost at the half time um, point now basically, um, we're kind of getting there with these sort of rules aren't we? They're not scoring as much as I thought they were. No, um, but the Buccaneers are <laughs> like winning so that's good, it's 14-6 to six, so and you've started to fancy Tom Brady haven't you? <laughs> They're not talking about it? actually decided to have the cake tomorrow haven't we yeah i don't know just too full for it yeah so can i wait till tomorrow after tomorrow's dinner i can't yeah <laughs> wait till tomorrow have it and it'll hopefully have set better than it yeah. as well so it is the next day and uh we're gonna have our sponge now and then sort of chillax probably do a bit of the quiz and um, like the questions for it anyway we are kind of expecting a the delivery which is quite exciting isn't it really um well we're excited about it so um we're hoping that that's going to come like well probably won't come today now but maybe tomorrow um but yeah it's completely different to like what we've ever done before really yeah. isn't it? it's quite exciting so hopefully that does come tomorrow <laughs> but we'll see if not you'll see it in the next sort of week's vlog <laughs> and thus concludes another lockdown vlog <laughs> yeah <laughs> Um, still no delivery from what we've been expecting, so hopefully in the next few days it will come and you'll see it in next week's vlog. Fingers crossed. Um, it's pretty exciting, isn't it? Well, we've got two exciting deliveries. If you say so. <laughs> <laughs> I do. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Be sure to check out our um, live stream quiz this Friday. We're doing like a rom-com sort of chick flick thing. Especially for Valentine's. So thank you guys for watching and have a magical day.